Tonight, our Hannah King talks with those helping to feed the need. We hope it's an iconic place for us to be. The gardens at Texas A&M span seven acres, a solemn space for teaching, research, and outreach. What we do is try and uh, take those foods and uh, give them to folks who uh, can benefit from the additional nutrition and uh, diversity in their diet. And we do that through the Brazos Valley Food Bank. Just in the last week, the gardens donated nearly 120 pounds of fresh produce to the Brazos Valley Food Bank. And so far this growing season, that totals 500 pounds pounds. Dr. Mike Arnold, director of the garden, says the produce has benefited the Brazos Valley Food Bank since the garden's roots were first planted nearly three years ago. Hunger is here and it's not only hunger, but it is the type of nutrition that's available. Um, oftentimes uh, groups that have lower socioeconomic income can't afford some of the fresh fruits and vegetables uh, that diversify their diets. The Brazos Valley Food Bank, which distributes these fresh finds, says it's fortunate to have A&M in their backyard. All of the efforts that they put forth with their garden directly benefits the people that we serve and we're able to turn around and get that basically fresh produce right as it was picked at its peak freshness and get it out to those that need it in our community. Ebony Knight with the Food Bank says the need existed before the pandemic and will well beyond it. We want to make sure we have solid relationships with various um, growers so that we can sustain that produce and those produce donations as well as other food donations throughout the entire year. You always got to be thinking ahead and in the garden so it's not just what you're harvesting today it's what you're planning on harvesting down the road. Every single pound counts toward ending hunger in the Brazos Valley and the gardens help chip away at the food deficiency. In College Station, Henny King, KRHD News.